So this is how you solve this question. First, you need to find the amount of drag in the 100 milliliter mixture. And so the way you do that is you take the 7.5 milligrams in 2.5 ml. So that will become some type of a concentration. So we have 7.5 milligrams in 2.5 milliliters. And then we can multiply this by the volume that we actually interested in. So times 100 milliliters, the ml will cancel out. And this would essentially give you 3000 milligrams. But we're going to be strategic here and convert the milligrams to grams. So a thousand milligrams is one gram. The milligrams cancels out and you end up with 0 0.3 grams. So we actually have 0 0.3 grams of the drug in 100 milliliters of the mixture. But we want to actually supply this 0 0.3 grams using the 10% injection. So we would recall that 10% is 10 grams in 100 milliliters, 10 grams of the drug in 100 milliliters of the solution. So we can set up a very nice proportion and the way we will do that is to write 10 grams in 100 milliliters is equal to the 0 0.3 grams divided by some unknown that we can call x. So we solve for x, x is going to be equal to 100 milliliters times 0 0.3 grams divided by 10 grams. The grams cancels out and what you have is 30 milliliters of the 10% injection. So that's how you solve this problem. Now for more practice problems, go check out the Pharmaceutical Calculations YouTube channel or go to rxcalculations.com.